Which here in Hamilton, students at Westmount Secondary School held the latest protest over the war in Gaza, and the calls are growing for Canada to push for an end to the violence. Al Sweeney has the details. At Westmount Secondary School, students left their classes to protest the violence in the Middle East, calling for the Canadian government to demand a ceasefire. A long overdue waco that calls for a ceasefire, an instant, long-lasting ceasefire. They say what's going on in Gaza is a tragedy that's reaching into their classrooms, demanding the school board and federal government speak out. Now recognizing Israel as a settler colonial state does not make a safe place for students not of only Palestinian de descent. Anyone of indigenous descent does not feel safe in this school property and not feel that their voices are heard. Organizers say the plan was for students to go into class, sit down, and then walk out in support of the Palestinians. On the river to the sea, Palestine will be free! Students rallied outside the school and marched along Mohawk Road on the Hamilton Mountain. The students say Canada can play a role in the Gaza crisis. Calling for a ceasefire, you know, hopefully. Instead of only helping Israel, they can start helping Palestine a little bit too. We're trying to help uh, Palestine and everything. Maybe with uh, this help, they can maybe uh, be a ceasefire. This is the latest in the protests that have taken place around the world, including a weekend demonstration in Toronto focused on children affected by the crisis, Israeli and Palestinian. How many children need to die before we speak out? On the Hamilton Mountain, protesters share the concern over the fate of children. It's about everything that's going on in Palestine, and it's really sad, honestly. Every, like, a lot of kids are dying, a lot of women and children. It's really sad. It shouldn't be happening. Ceasefire now! Ceasefire now! Al Sweeney, CACH News.